I have just cut off the bottom hem and now I'm going to cut off the inseam. I go and trim the other side of the seam which is quite bulky. Now I place the denim so that the two crotch points are on either side. Then you get a nice big panel. I just go and cut off from the end of the crotch to the other end of the crotch. I can cut off the pockets and use it on my projects later on. And now what I do, I just trim the seams in the side. I just go and cut off the other side of the seam. I have cut out all the pieces and ironed them flat. So you can see, okay, basically what we need to do is cut these panels straight so that we get nice wide panels. To do that, I'm going to use my cutting mat and trim this with a rotary cutter. Turn this around and again cut this with a straight edge. Okay, now take the two panels that have got the straight edges together, place them next to each other. They need to join in a perfect straight line. And then cut a strip of Shape Easy. Take a strip of Shape Easy, place it down on the joint with the glue side facing down. Press it with a hot iron. Steam seems to take away the glue effect. I tend to do it with just dry iron without the steam. We go and sew a zigzag stitch to close these two panels together. And while we're doing this, the Shape Easy will hold it together and help us sew it better. Keep your zigzag to the widest on your machine. Place the center of the foot aligning to the center join where the two fabrics join and then sew a zigzag stitch. So this is the shape easy and we have sewn the zigzag stitch. If I hold it closer you can see it's a flat fabric. If you want a wider panel all you do is you just go and join one more and then you get such a wide piece of fabric to work with. Okay, here we are. We have joined three panels and we have got such a large piece of fabric to work with. If you want this to be bigger panel, just, just go ahead and attach other panel towards this one. Usually we can work with three panels because this is large enough for a bag or a cushion, but we have got other piece left over. This was, this was quite a wide legged denim that I used and quite an old fashioned one and it hasn't got any stretch in it. I have also joined a four panel. This was a skinny jeans, but this just tells you how much of fabric you can get even in a skinny jeans. So on a wide leg jeans, it's three panels. On a skinny jeans, you attach four panels and you get this width of fabric. Do you want measurements? This is approximately about 25 inches wide and on a fold, it's about 13 inches high, which is large enough for any projects that you would want to do.